Miro is a collaboration platform that helps teams streamline their innovation process. It's a workspace where teams conduct unstructured and structured work in boards, docs, timelines, diagrams, and tables. We call it the innovation workspace. Let's create a new board to start. To move around the infinite canvas on the trackpad, just drag two fingers across the trackpad and pinch your fingers to zoom in and out like you would on a smartphone. If you're using a mouse, right-click and drag to move around and zoom in or out using the scrolling mouse wheel. Let's bring our attention to the toolbar. Whether we're adding basic objects like shapes or an intricate table synced with Jira, this toolbar is our go-to spot for adding content to the canvas. Let's start with a sticky note. Select the sticky icon and click anywhere on the canvas to place it, and type to add text. As we put our thoughts and ideas on sticky notes, this canvas can become unwieldy, so we'll add structure with frames. To add a frame, select the frame icon and click to add it to the board. Now, if you want to move the frame around, click the frame and the content within it will move too. You can use a text box to title this frame so everyone will know what is going on at a glance. Instead of starting from scratch, we can use Miro's robust library of templates. Click the icon on the toolbar and search for a template that fits your needs. Then add it to the board. Now we can customize. We'll click, hold, and drag to select multiple objects and drag them where we want them to go. To duplicate an object, we'll select it and click Command or Control D. Finally, we can use the context menu to change how an object looks. When we're ready, we'll share our board with others using the sharing settings. With edit access, collaborators can jump in and add content, or you can restrict their access to comment or view only privileges. In this video, we focused on the essentials. Be sure to explore the Learning Center in the bottom right of the board. Here, you'll find tutorials and videos, as well as links to Miro Academy and the Help Center. These are resources to help you get the most out of Miro.